there were uh, even Nancy has released what they are, they call water boom shit, like bomb, boom. Everywhere is now on fire because of her and her story. Apparently, guys, even Nancy D wrote a book, and uh, which is she titled "I Am Not Even Nancy." Hmm. But this book na bombo, the bomb eh, uh, it bombastic so many people. As this book is a revelation book, revealing her life, revealing everything. You guys will be shocked to hear the one where she don't release. Okay, I'll be taking a step out ahead though because hey. But before we go more details, if you are new here, you are highly welcome. Do consider to smash on the like and follow button to join the family. And to my consistent viewers, thank you guys so much for all your love and support. I do not take the love for granted. So let's head into today's video. You guys, if Nancy, like I said, say she release a revelation book she wrote huh so she's one she wrote louis and said uh, according to people that read the book they have been releasing the boom bump that she wrote about her life story in this particular book and this one she called about shakiti this uh ghanaian rapper okay popular uh, ghanaian rapper so according to her, she and this Ghanaian rapper did had a relationship. Um, so I'm reading the book. She wrote and said, according to in the chapter, they said, I would call what we had, according to Ivan Nancy, you know, we developed was a serious relationship. I gravitated towards people in the music industry. For the longest time in my life, music was my getaway from all the unpleasant things life threw at me. So I liked this talent. We started talking and got close and closer. Part of the book, okay, said, as captured in chapter 8 of her memo, launched on Sunday, June 18, 2023, the actress attempt to abort the baby by taking some concussion from a colleague, but to her dismay, the substance could not work as tested, reviewed. She was still pregnant. The first thing that hit me, she wrote, so I'm reading what she wrote, guys, what was in the book. When he said no to keeping the pregnancy was my own life. I had grown up, grew up without a father in my life. I had often been reminded of how I have been um, born by mistake. I was still wondering if the man who, whose name I bore was my father. How was I going to bring another human being into this world to live like me? Someone who father would reject him or her as Mr. Nelson had rejected me. If there were, was a way to spare someone else, that trauma I was contending, contending with. Why would I reject that opinion, especially when I was not? She further recalled finally succeeding in aborting the pregnancy, but said it is one of the most regrettable mistakes in her life, in my life, if the clock of life could be removed to my younger self i would keep it so this is it telling us that she had a relationship with shaki tai abi shaki did they call him a ghanaian rapper so but they had she had to terminate it because of her life story she didn't want her child to go through things that she went through um for me my own opinion i think that we can't blame her me i can't blame her it's her decision back then even though she didn't know much better back then it's good that now she's also regretting and knows um what she lost okay so it's better for her to embrace her new self now and move on that, that